I greet you in the love and the light of the infinite creator. A deeper understanding of time as a physical process and why we have an uncertain future could change our philosophy and even our spirituality. Take the story of the man born disabled with a club foot. He goes to a spiritual teacher and asks, Why should I be born with this disability? And the spiritual teacher looks up and says, This is karma. You must have kicked your mother in a previous life. This simple story really highlights the type of philosophy that we can create if we have no fundamental understanding of the physical process that forms the future and the past with cause and effect. If we don't understand the process that forms the moment of now and cause and effect with an uncertain future, we can only make up stories based on our incomplete picture of reality. Or we can say that everything is consciousness and that physical reality is just an illusion. Either way we are left with something that is incomplete and feels wrong. Below the details of this video I have placed links to videos that explain the universe as a continuum based on a universal process of energy exchange. This process is relative to the atoms of the periodic table with a built-in uncertainty that is formed by light interacting with the electron probability cloud that surrounds each atom. In such a theory, the wave-particle duality of light and matter in the form of electrons is forming a blank canvas that we can interact with, forming the possible into the actual. In this theory, the future is continuously unfolding with each photon-electron coupling or dipole moment relative to the energy and momentum of our actions. In my other videos, I explained how this can be based on the four fundamental forces of nature, with different phase changes in matter changing how the process unfolds at different temperatures. But in this video, I want to challenge these ideas of philosophy by explaining a creative interactive process with the future unfolding relative to the energy and momentum of our own actions. This can be in the form of art, poetry, music, or even mathematics. Light has momentum, and momentum is frame-dependent. Therefore, we have a process that will form reference frames, with the momentum being a driving force, with the past forming the potential for the future. But consciousness is not part of this process. Conscious awareness always remains in the moment of now, in the center of its own reference frame. This theory explains this by explaining conscious awareness in its most simple form as electrical activity in the brain that is aware of its own electrical potential. Therefore, conscious awareness is the most advanced part of a universal process of energy exchange and can comprehend this process as the passage or continuum of time. Thanks for watching. Please sub and share. It will help the promotion of this theory.